Hello, I hope you're doing well. So this vlog is going to be starting off in the children's playroom and I did mention in the previous videos that I was going to be clearing it out and getting rid of a few things and not only that, now that I am in a better place I have consciously started making decisions about decluttering and you know letting go of things and keeping things, rearranging, redecorating and whatnot. So for this for the next week or so um i would say about a week because i have finished filming and editing a lot of videos and i have few on the way and things like that but anyway so for this week um for my second channel i won't be posting which is why i'm gonna have a bit of a free time and then starting from february it's going to be one video each on each channel and now um i just thought i was going to you know um, start maybe start from my room start okay so let's start about my life before I was living a mindful or like um, a very cluttered filled life so let's just say I just didn't even know the difference we grew up I grew up in London and you know um, shared a room with my sister and it was what it was then after I got married um, when I moved here, I remember having about eight suitcases of things. So that could consist of like other things, but um, it could be my shoes and mainly would be clothes. I have a, I had a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff, and um, even thinking about it now, it feels ridiculous because I don't know why. But I had a lot of clothes back then and um, few shoes. And then from then on, after I had my son, and around in 2019, it was when I discovered this whole, you know, of uh, the fast fashion and things like that. And although I don't like to deprive myself of certain things, I also feel responsible uh, for, you know, consuming mindfully. So a lot of times I've started uh, going to charity shops um, nowadays and finding things there. And honestly, you can find extreme rare gems there sometimes. And I've started to do that. Um, I also don't shop as often and also don't get things unless I need it like it has to be i'll leave it in my basket for a few days and there's different kind of things you can do to avoid you know impulse buying things like that but there are times i just buy things because i really like them and there are times i can resist them so it just depends and i don't like to deprive myself of anything but i feel like i'm doing the best i can and we all are and there's no like judgment in it judging judgment for anyone people who like to live a minimal lifestyle and there are people who like to live a maximum lifestyle and that's just up to the individual really for this vlog what we're gonna focus on is decluttering reorganizing rearranging so let's get that
these are the full on dresses that I'll be keeping this year. There are the other dresses that I'm going to turn into like a cord set. But this is it. So my dresses are going in here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Dresses and sh shirt dresses, like dress dresses. I, no, it's not, not dresses, these are tops. Yeah. Alright, show me what you got, Samantha. I got a walk, a wreath, an autumn wreath, and a pine cone. Oh, is this your collection? Yeah. This what about baby? Show me baby cone. Yeah. What's baby so tiny? Your dad like, oh, honey? Baby cone, okay. Rock. Any? No, I want this. Oh, you want to do it yourself? Okay. I scrolled uh -huh. my kick. Uh, Kill button and stuff. Uh, wait. Oh, yay. No, baby. It's an autumn leaf. It's a bit. It's an autumn leaf. Oh, a broken one. It's a broken one. So careful. Mm -hmm. <laughs> This is a weird angle. I think I started my. Was it Tuesday? I'm sure it's Tuesday. I think so. Regardless of the day, we are somewhere in between and almost done. Sometimes I like to. I not I like to. I tend to underestimate things, and it takes longer than usual. And that's the case with this bedroom. Um. However, I know I started off the vlog saying that I'm going to start decluttering and pat on the back for me because I noticed that I was very careful with what I was buying and what I was not buying I, I noticed that literally I got rid of maybe one item of clothing just um, I've got to like start thinking logically you know putting things where I will need them so like a lot of like my bath bombs were in my cupboard I need them in the bathroom, so I swapped them there, put them there. A lot of like backup stuff for like the bathroom was in my cupboard, which needs to go either in the store area where other like backup stuff are, or the bathroom. And then saw like things for my hobbies, uh, like the new hobbies that I'm going to be trying and new things that I'm going to be creating. Those were in my cupboards too, so that I put. I'm going to put in my storage area too. I'm like shocked. I thought there was going to be like pile and pile of things here, but these are all the things I need to find a home for, and that's really it. I'm gonna get to uh, hoovering and like sorting out, rearranging, let's say, the um, space under the ottoman bed. Ottoman bed. You wanna sit down? Okay, go ahead. What's up? Then all the things on the top there, you see, I feel like I'm gonna have space in the ottoman bed, and then I'm gonna put those there. Finally, this is all my plain saris and all the blouse and petticoat that comes with it. A few more there. Finally done, but hopefully, I feel like there's more to do. The room should be done by today. Mm -hmm.